Hey guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you are new here, hi I'm Lauren, I don't know how you found me but please definitely stay. So today's video is a wardrobe tour, so showing you all in my wardrobe, how I've designed it, where I got it from and some of the organisation bits in there as well. I still need to buy whole new clothes for my wardrobe. I started buying a few little bits but a little bit's better than nothing. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. So this is my wardrobe, which I got from Ikea. It's an Ikea Paxed wardrobe. I designed it myself and I've literally put all the shelves in the way I want it, the rails, etc. So let's start in here. So like I said, it's the Ikea Pax wardrobe. You can either have it with the doors or without. So I've got a shelf up there. I will explain about them in a minute. Then I've got a rail here, which obviously drags down to here. I've got a shelf here, a pull out drawer here. I will explain everything in a second. And then I've got two drawers and one of these little plastic netted ones are down here as well and then I'll explain about the other one as well so up here I have two of these Ikea storages I actually got them from Amazon but you can actually get them from Ikea as well obviously with the wardrobe I can't link in the description box below because obviously I designed it myself but you can actually go onto the Ikea website and design a wardrobe that's suitable for you. I have always wanted an Ikea Pax wardrobe, so I finally got one. So these storages, I, like I said, I got them from Amazon. I will leave them in the description box below for you guys. I've got two up here, one for summer shoes and one for the winter shoes. So I've popped labels on them so I can see what I have inside them. Then obviously I have my rail here, I've got all my clothes. This is not all of my clothes, I've got some of my clothes still on the rail. All my new clothes are in here, so like all these um, like autumn ones are all in here. Um, I've replaced the autumn ones for the old ones and I've put the old ones on my rail. So now I've got a full wardrobe full of all new clothes and then I can then get rid of all my old ones on my rail. Then I have, I don't know if you guys can see, this storage here. I will leave it in the description box below for you guys as well. But I wanted something, like a nice little storage to go under here because I have my throws, bedding, beach towels and Christmas bits in here. So I've actually vacuum packed them. You probably won't be able to see. Um, but I've actually vac packed them, put them all in vac packs so they're all nice and flat because when I put them in here last week, I think it was, it was so big and bulky, it came to, up to about here and all my clothes was like that. So I've all vac packed them so they're all nice and flat so I could fit so much stuff in. Um, I've also got our autumn slash um, Halloween bedding in there as well so yeah I will leave this in the description box below as well as the fat pack bags in there as well then I have a pull out drawer here um, which is just under obviously my clothes I have my two cases of sunglasses I actually got these from Amazon I absolutely love these they keep your sunglasses nice and secure and away from any dust let's open them up so you guys can see a little bit more better um i will leave the link in the description box below for these but obviously i've got two of these i need to fill this one up because i've still got a few more spaces and then i have these beautiful trays here with a few little things in um, I've got obviously my Pandora bracelets there, my earrings. I need to fill up these bits, but I don't know what to put in them just yet. And then this one here, I've got my watches and some little necklaces and bracelets here. A lovely Diamante heart set there and a sister necklace there. I've got my watches here. And then I've got my purses here, which I've got my Barbie one there, which my mother-in-law got for me. My everyday um, dupe of the Gucci purse here and my Dior purse just here. 
going to say too much about this drawer because this is my underwear drawer but i have got these storages i wanted to show you these storages actually these are the ikea um storages i can't remember the actual name of them but you can actually get from ikea and you can get them from amazon which i've got mine from i will leave the link in the description box below you can set these at different styles so i've got a big one here here and here and here then i have like a um medium one there small one there plus some odd socks and then i've got two big ones there for like period pads and stuff so yeah i just wanted to show you them in this drawer here i am still deciding of what to do with it at the moment um i've kept it kind of empty these are my birthday presents from nathan don't worry about them um i've got these containers here at the moment i don't know what to put in them at the moment i don't know whether to pop some makeup in there and then have half clothes or have it all closed i don't know yet i'm still deciding on this drawer then in at this drawer i've got all my pajamas so i have all my like trouser sets here which is mostly all my disney ones i've got nighties there some more disney trouser sets there all my silk ones there um short sets here and my halloween sets there um it will be a bit more tidier i've obviously still got loads more to do um and more pajamas to buy um but i don't know whether to i did actually buy some organizations to go in here but they were too big and i couldn't fit that many pajamas in and i absolutely lo love and live in my pajamas and then the last drawer down here is just got my leggings and cycling shorts so i've got everyday leggings that i wear for work there i've got my leather, leather look leggings there i've got my jeans there my every other day leggings there so that i can wear like if i'm going out or anything i don't want to wear them ones and all this lot is all cycling shorts literally loads so i've got all them there and i've just got a few little bits just down here so i've got a couple of acrylic trays full of like um sprays like some little glitter sprays and stuff and then i've got my beauty works makeup bag there my glossy box one and a few other little makeup bags there i thought i'd pop them there because i've got nowhere else to put them at the moment so that is this side of the wardrobe done now moving on to this side and this is what it's looking like so again i've got a shelf at the top i've got a rail here which is kind of a lovely kind of small little area i did visions of having um four kind of shelves and then a rail and then a smaller um shelving up there but i changed my mind at the last minute as i normally do then i have a shelf here don't worry about all this i will explain in a second i have a shelf here and then i have another pull out drawer here and then i have another basket thing here so moving on to the top so these two storages again they're from ikea but you can actually get them from amazon where i got these ones from um i've got exactly the same just a little bit lower down so i can show you a little bit better but these ones have my sorry my uh camera's not focusing there we go um this one's got my christmas accessories bits in like all my christmas socks in and this one's got all my christmas clothes in i am thinking about getting fact pack bags to go in there so i can put more christmas clothes in there as well because at the moment it's a bit jammed packed then here obviously you can see i've got all my hangers here um don't worry about this area because it's completely not finished i've still got to get a really nice jewelry box to go in here obviously these two are staying this one is a diy one which i've done um last year i think it was or beginning of this year if you remember this was the jewelry box that my mum bought me for christmas a long 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 time ago and the color of it did not match our bedroom so we decided to paint that white and then this is a mrs hinch one that i think my cousin bought me for christmas and then i've just got a little trinket box there obviously a box of hair dye there um which will not be staying there and then obviously our little saving money pot there 
And then here we have another set of the IKEA storages. Again, I will list these in the description box below. I'll only list one set, even though I've got two. Um, but this is what the other one is looking like. So it's exactly the same style layout, but this one's obviously got my normal winter accessories. And then I've got all my bags in here. Um, if you don't know what these look like, I will just move this one out of the way so you can see. That is what they look like. They come in two different sizes as well. You can get this one, which I think is the smaller size, and then you can actually get a bigger size as well. Um, and it's exactly the same on IKEA as well. So you can get two different sizes. Um, these are from IKEA as well, but I got them from Amazon. And down here, I've actually done this myself and I'm actually quite pleased really. So I got these storages from Amazon. I will link them in the description box below. I think I mentioned these in my Amazon finds, I think. Um, I absolutely love these. They're so big and you can fit so much stuff in. And obviously I've got four of them. So in that one at the back, I've got all my body lotions. This one at the back here. Um, I've got all my tanning stuff, then I've got this two at the front, which I've got my body mists in, and then I've got all the Dove sprays here. Now, if you're wondering why have you got so many Dove sprays, I like to keep stocked up because obviously Christmas is coming up. I need to spend most of all my money on Christmas presents, so I need to make sure I've got enough of everything. So I've got them in different kind of scents. I've got, um, I'm actually using Fresh right now. So you've got powder, um, classic and floral they all smell absolutely amazing and I love it and I love the way these are styled as well these are actually fridge storages um, but yeah I use them for my wardrobe and I absolutely love them and moving on to this little pull out drawer here I don't know whether this is going to stay like this it might all be moved around um, but I have these gold trays again um, I should have mentioned these when I showed you in the other part of the wardrobe um, but these are from Amazon and obviously I've got four of them here so I've got ones with our batteries in because everything has to come with batteries nowadays then we've got our wax melts in here our essential oils in here which we've got quite a lot of them and then I've just got some wipes and some makeup br brush removers here um, yeah I don't know if that's going to stay like that at the moment it could all change you never know I like to move things about now this is empty at the moment this did have spare like um, cotton balls and stuff in but I moved them into the spare room into a box um, because this eventually will store all my bikinis so obviously once we've come back from Tenerife and everything all my bikinis can live in here so they'll be nice and stored away and then I wanted to show you this as well so this is our collapsible laundry basket some people are thinking why have you got a laundry basket in the bottom of your wardrobe well we like to do our own clothes sometimes so i thought you know what get our own laundry basket which can collapsible and it can just hide straight there and it's easy put away it's not in the way of everything you don't have to keep picking it up and moving it you can just collapse it down and pop it away and i think it looks really nice and tidy as well so that's is this side of the wardrobe and i think it's coming along very very nicely most of all my stuff is from amazon but i absolutely love them these storage boxes like i said they are from ikea but you can get them from amazon and i absolutely love them I will try and leave links to everything that I showed you throughout this video in the description box below for you guys. The only thing that I can't list is the wardrobe because obviously like I said it's a PAX wardrobe, I designed it myself. But you can go on to the IKEA website, type in PAX wardrobes, they come up with so many PAX wardrobes so you can actually buy them separately, you can design your own or you can 
buy them without doors or buy them with doors but yeah you can actually design your own wardrobe which i absolutely love i've been wanting a packed wardrobe for so long now and i finally have one and it's just my literally dream wardrobe ever it's coming along nicely and i'm so happy with it so without further ado that is going to conclude today's video i hope you guys have enjoyed if you have as always give it a like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one Bye, guys.